It has been a little over a year since 39-year-old Diego Garcia was killed while working at the Georgetown Toyota plant. His family is now speaking out about his death. They say the company had Garcia doing a job a contractor was meant to do when he died. WKYT's Alyssa Williams sat down with his family to learn more. Diego was like sunshine on a cloudy day, mm -hmm. so he was always smiling. I mean, you can ask anybody. He was just energetic, constantly positive, um, a go-getter. He was a force in life. All that Kristen Poe has left of her husband, Diego Garcia, is memories after he was killed in a work-related accident at the Georgetown Toyota plant in 2022. Garcia was reportedly helping a co-worker remove lockers from a hallway when the lockers tipped over and hit Garcia's head, pinning him to the ground. He later died at a hospital. On the day of his death, he was very concerned about moving these heavy steel lockers because it is considered a contractor's job. He was told to do it anyways. Since his death, Post says she's been impacted not only emotionally, but financially as well. The death benefits were supposed to be handed to me within the week of his death. I did not receive those death benefits until June 2023. Mm -hmm. I had to sell my home because I was sitting on not knowing when I was gonna receive money from different entities. The Occupational Safety and Health Administration did launch a safety inspection regarding this incident. For those who are filing several safety penalties against Toyota worth $18,750. Poe now says she wants to be a voice for her husband. God forbid this happen ever again, that Toyota will pull through for those widows or widowers and their children and that they won't have to face what we've faced as a family because Toyota neglected us. In Georgetown, Alyssa Williams, WKYT. Representatives from Toyota's Georgetown plant released a statement to WKYT saying, quote, the loss of Diego Garcia on November 15th, 2022 was a tragic accident. The incident occurred while performing non-standard work. Employee safety is a top priority for Toyota, and we continue to work closely and cooperatively with the agency investigation. Our deepest sympathies go to Diego's family and friends, end quote.